내가 Good to see you again. I'm going to introduce you to the strengths and weaknesses of the defensive baseline playstyle. Then we'll go over how to master this playstyle. Baseline defense players are very technically sound when it comes to forehands and backhands. This allows them to aim their shots with precision, especially control shots, and forces their opponent to move around the court a lot. Baseline defenders are also very fast and remain in good shape throughout a match. Because of this, they are able to return balls that other players might not be able to return. Their main weaknesses are serve, volley, and power. Instead of relying on powerful shots or serves to take the advantage in a rally, they work towards getting points from the baseline using their precise shots. The go-to play for baseline defense is to use control shots. Topspin control shots are particularly efficient at moving an opponent when aimed short and cross-court. Slice shots are also useful to neutralize an opponent by making them play low balls. That sums up the most important things you need to know. Next up, we will go through more specific lessons in practice. Baseline defense players can aim their control shots with surgical precision because of their high forehand and backhand attributes. This forces their opponent to cover a lot of ground and to return shots far from the center of the court. In particular, topspin control shots are the most efficient shots for moving your opponent far from the center of the court with short cross-court shots. All right, now win some points using control shots. Focus on your timing. Next one. Playing defense, remember to use control shots to conserve your energy and get your opponent running to neutralize their offense. Feel free to jump to the next lesson or to replay this one for extra practice. Welcome to another baseline defense lesson. Tactically, you want to wear your opponent down when you are playing defense from your baseline. The best way to do that is to move your opponent around during longer rallies and reduce their rally energy. 
Opponents that are low on rally energy will become tired and make more mistakes. Okay, now wear them down by moving them around the court. Focus on your timing. in between the lines. defense that you want to wear your opponent down and let them make a mistake. I have some more to teach you when you're ready. Good to see you. In this lesson, we will cover using passing shots. Knowing how to react against an opponent coming to the net is important for a baseline defensive player. The first thing to do is to not panic and wait for a good opportunity to try a passing shot. 
Put your opponent in a bad position first and force them to return a weak shot. Let your opponent get in close and then hit a winner past them. Balls at waist height, that's the best time to strike. is at the net. Just stay calm and look for an opportunity for a passing shot. Now you can run through this again if you would like, or move on to the next lesson. Hey, this is it. It's time to test what you have learned about baseline defense. You will be playing a tough opponent, so remember to move them around with control shots to tire them out, and look for opportunities to pass them when they are at the net. Okay, show me what you got. Great progress. Great work. for reaching the end of the baseline defense playstyle lessons. If you ever want a refresher, you can always run them again.